Avogadro's law states that equal volumes of gases at the same temperature and pressure contain the same amount of particles. This means it doesn't matter what gas it is, once the conditions are the same, the number of moles present will be the same. Two conditions to consider are room temperature and pressure, and in this case, one mole occupies 24 dm cubed. If we were told to find the volume of 0.33 moles of carbon dioxide at RTP, we would simply multiply that by 24 because each mole occupies 24 dm cubed. If we're asked to find how many moles of oxygen representing 150 centimeters cubed, the very first thing we need to do is to convert from centimeter cubed to dm cubed, since our statement is in dm cubed. To convert from centimeters cubed to dm cubed, divide by 1000. So, 150 centimeters cubed would be equal to 0 0.15 dm cubed. Once we have that in dm cubed, we would see how many times we can get 24 from 0.15. This tells us the number of moles present. The second condition to consider is STP, or standard temperature and pressure. At STP, one mole occupies 22.4 dm cubed. If we were told that we had 0.12 moles of neon at STP and we wanted to find the volume, we would multiply 0.12 by 22.4 since every mole occupies 22.4 dm cubed at STP. We should find the number of moles of chlorine gas present in 400 centimeters cubed. Again, we have to convert from centimeters cubed to dm cubed by dividing by a thousand. 400 centimeters cubed is equal to 0 0.4 dm cubed. To find the number of moles, we would see how many times 22.4 goes into 0 0.4. To find the volume of 0.12 moles of neon gas at STP, we would simply multiply 0.12 times 22.4 since every mole occupies 22.4 dm cubed at STP.